Hello learners, this is Sam from Tiger Schooling and in this session of the video we will be talking about the structure, the basic structure of a neuron, nothing in detail about it, the basic structure of the neuron, we're not going to talk about the types of it and the uh, after this video we'll be going to upload another video which will be about the types of the neuron and the neuroglial cells which are actually the supportive of the neuron. So the neurons are actually the you can call them nervous system cells which actually make your whole nervous system including your the cells of the brain your spinal cord and all the nerve all the neurons that are in your body you know embedded in each and everywhere uh, that's why you feel sensation because of the uh, these so these neurons actually pass information through an electric impulse and in your brain in a human brain there are about 86 billion uh, neuron cells so these neurons uh, are actually and how they survive and how who help them these neurons are actually supported by the glial cells which is another group of uh, cells uh, about there are four types of uh, glial cells in the brain and the, uh, and the, uh, the actual central nervous system but as we go down uh, we've got we get to into two there are total six uh, types of the main six types of neural cells and there are uh, three other basic types of neurons actually three basic types of neurons which we'll be going to discuss in another video But let's first get to this one All right, uh, this is the basic structure. We will be getting started from here from the dendrite So actually what happens the dendrite the neuron actually receives message from another neuron through the exon terminal There are exon terminals over here and this information is reached to the dendrites this is the starting so you can start from the dendrite then from the dendrite the information is is received by this area which is actually a cytoplasm but uh, we call this area as soma which is the body of the neuron and in that body of the neuron we got nucleus it's, it's a cytoplasm over here and information actually from this area to the you know reaching from moving from the dendrite to the soma it actually moves uh, towards the axon this is the axon but this point remember the point this is kind of v-shaped point uh, over here which is actually called the axon hillock axon hillock which is actually entry point of uh, from the soma to the axon so you enter the electric impulse enter from here and move through this uh, axon and reach to the terminal part which is called the axon terminal and further on this information will be moving to other dendrites and there are a few two other structures in this area we're not going to talk about them in detail but i'm going to tell you uh, their importance a little bit we have got this schwann cell which is also kind of a glial cell which actually support the axon uh, and it helps in another thing we will just in a bit telling you and one thing more structure that is this row node of Renovir. it's actually a space between the schwann cells and there is a really important of this uh, space this area is just called the node of Renovir. Uh, but we're not going to discuss it here because uh, uh, this is space this node of Renovir. i'm just telling you a little bit uh, the signals sometime what happened the signals which come across this area do not pass these schwann cells but move in in this kind of section in this way all right not moving straightward but actually jumping through the node of Renovir and actually it helps you know preserve a lot of uh, electric impulse we are not losing a lot of impulse and it's very uh, it's very beneficial uh, for the uh, for the information to go across other new uh, other neurons and this is really helpful that is the node of Renovir all right, this is the basic structure of the neuron, including the dendrite, soma, and axon, and this is all about the basic structure. That's it. That's so simple. If you need to ask anything, please make sure to comment us and let us know how we can help you in your studies. Thank you.